Shama and Kalud are baking cakes for my charity sale. What do you say? Maybe you boys could help too. Mm, we would love to, Mom, but uh... We are very uh busy with uh, uh things. Yeah, things. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we're very busy with uh, lots of things. Uh, are we? I was pretty happy watching TV. Yes. What kind of things, Salem? Uh, things. Yeah, like? Very important. Secret things. Very important secret things, you say? Hmm, really? Mansoor, you know very well you shouldn't have secrets kept from your mother. Well, maybe I can help. How about if the best cake wins a small cash prize, huh? Would that make these very important secret things you have to do seem less important? Oh, yeah! Hmm, okay then. I need three cakes to be baked. So you guys can split into teams. Kalud and Shama, could you make a honey uh -huh. and date cake? Hmm, <laughs> <laughs> turkey and salem. You can make a chocolate cake. <laughs> and Mansoor and Obeyed, you can make a Victoria sponge. Yeah! <laughs> Baking is very scientific. It's just a process where one transforms the properties of the ingredients by mixing, by the introduction of catalysts, and the application of heat. No! Baking is about making things with love taste super delicious and yummy. Yes, Obeyed, but it's the science that makes it taste delicious. No, no, Mansur. It's actually the icing that makes it taste delicious. Hmm, I think we have everything we need. We do. This cake shouldn't take too long to make, hopefully. We're going to win this easily. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Oh, geez, mm. I don't know what half these things are. Salem, stop eating everything. Why? Because we need them. There's more than enough. <gasps> Fascinating. It says a sponge cake requires the perfect balance of structure building from the flour uh. and the eggs combined uh. with the structure weakening from the fat and sugar. There's gonna be a structure inside the cake? Walls in the cake? I don't think that would taste very good. Um, mm, try adding a little more, I think. Yes, I think you're right. Mm -hmm. Have you seen the chocolate? Uh, did we need it? Of course we need chocolate. It's for a chocolate cake. Don't tell me. Did you eat it? Just a little. Oh, great. Now I need to go to the store and buy more thanks to you. <laughs> Feeding the butter and the sugar together adds tiny bubbles to the mixture, which divide the mixture into sheets, which gives a cake that melts in the mouth texture. Don't stop then. I love that kind of texture. Mm -hmm. That's a winning cake if I ever saw one. I was never in doubt. Ah. Mm. Ah. Ow. Mm. Ow. Ow. The egg protein coats each of the gas bubbles, protecting it from collapsing when heated. Wow, so the eggs know to protect each other from all the gas bubbles? Are they some kind of special eggs? Or are they superhero eggs? Oh, and if they really are superheroes, mm, do they have little capes? Do they have superpowers? Do they fight crime? Ah! <laughs> 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 Hey, Salem, I'm back! I've got the chocolate and, uh... Where's our mixture? In the bowl? No, no, I mean the rest of it. Uh... 
Did you eat it? Uh, Salem! I was hungry, and I wanted to make sure the cake was yummy. <laughs> you shouldn't eat uncooked cake mix. You'll get sick, don't you know? It's bad for you. Uh, I do feel a bit queasy. Well, that's great. Then you can just get out of the way and leave me alone. It'll be easier to bake this cake without you eating everything. If it's any help, I can tell you it's yummy. But if it's anything like you, it's of no help at all. I'm sick of the stupid baking and being bossed around. I wish they would go away. Uh, hello? Mansoor? Obeyed? Turkey? Come out! This isn't funny! Where are you? Mansoor! Obeyed! Turkey? Where are they? Shama? Kalud? There's no one anywhere. They disappeared. Is anyone there? Uh, is anyone there? Anyone? Anyone? Where is everyone? Where's everyone? Are they gone? Well, at least it's nice and peaceful. No one to boss me around. Ah! 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 Solemn, you were in the living room, not the moon. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it felt like. I woke up and there was no one here, no one anywhere. Not in the streets or in the park. I was just sitting there and this massive scary cake monster showed up. It was trying to crush me. And then it sent massive cupcakes flying after me until I was trapped. You mean a monster cake like this one? <laughs> <laughs> So, which one of you won? Who gets the small cash prize? Turkey, what's going on? You look like some kind of cake monster. <laughs> Marcel!
Welcome to the annual science fair. Science is the study of the world around us, how it works and why it works the way it does. Science makes the impossible possible. Science puts men on the moon and computers in our pockets. And I'm very excited to see what all of our young scientists have in store for us today. This year, I'm pleased to announce that our winners will receive an exclusive VIP tour no. of the Science Museum, as well as a lump sum cash prize. Let the judging commence. Good luck to you all. Uh, <laughs> aha, a Van der Graaff generator. It's quite harmless. Carry on, Mafid. The Van der Graaff generator can build a huge static electricity charge of well over one million volts. That's right, but with a very low current. Watch. <laughs> Your utra is flapping up. Ah, excellent work, Mafid. <laughs> Hello, Tarek. So what have you got here? Well, sir, as you can see, it's a modeled volcano. And inside the crater is a beaker of baking soda. Go pour some vinegar inside of it. The vinegar is reacting with the baking soda. And then we dyed the baking soda with red food coloring to make it look as if it were real lava. Isn't science amazing, Teacher Ali? Excellent, very inventive. Thank you, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Aha, Mansoor. What have we got here? Thank you, sir. Meet Nadir. Say hello, Nadir. Greetings. Well, hello there. Nice to meet you, Nadir. Tell us more about Nadir, Mansoor. The robot can be remote controlled by an app I created on my smartphone. He's designed to do a wide variety of things, such as cleaning, lifting, moving things, or even hazardous tasks that might not be safe for humans. Amazing. Huh. Can you demonstrate? Uh, Nadir, fetch that ball. Hmm? Uh huh? Bats. Bats. Very nice. Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. And he's strong. Watch this. <laughs> Nadir, bend the bar. Whoa. Bend. Incredible, amazing. We can use him on the school jujitsu team. Excellent work, boys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Firstly, I'd like to thank everybody for participating in our science fair. There were a great many interesting projects that we saw. And this year's winners are... <gasps> Mansoor, Obeyed, and Salam for their robot. Yeah! <laughs> Watch this, you guys. Hmm? <laughs> you ready? <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Just giving that metal man a bath. He stinks. <laughs> He's gone crazy! Oh. He's short-circuiting! Run! Oh. Evacuate! Evacuate! Let's get out of here! before he destroys the whole school. Mansoor, you can't stop that thing on your own. Right, Obeid will help you. I'm out of here. Stalin, we're a team. I guess we can all die together. Thanks, guys. Okay, let's go. Where did he go? I'm pretty sure he went this way. No way, we can't fight something that strong. 
Not fight him. We have to disable him. Pull out his batteries or something. Hmm. So you really want to get that close to a gigantic, crazy, psycho on the run robot? Okay. I've got it. Follow me. Oh. Come on. <laughs> okay. So the foam from Tarek's volcano caused the robot to short circuit, right? Uh. And so, if we can get him even wetter, the batteries will fail. Mom. Yeah. Ha! Let's roll out. I think we're safe. Why are we here trying to destroy a giant killer rampaging robot with mobs? That's not what I call safe. What we need is an ambush. Great idea, Salem. We'll draw him towards us for an all out surprise attack. Right, but we are still going to need some bait. Hmm. What do you think we can use as bait? <laughs> huh? Oh, no, not me. Come on. <laughs> I should have stayed quiet. <sighs> well, here goes nothing. Hey, rust bucket! <laughs> wait, wait, no, 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 I don't want to get bent. <laughs> Eat this! <laughs> Harmless to humans, but lethal for robots. Wow. I think we just destroyed the entire school. Hey, Tarek, we need more cement. <laughs> yeah, well, if you need it so bad, why don't you come and get it yourself then? Uh, maybe I'll send the robot to get it. No, 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 it's, it's okay. Oh, we got this. <laughs> Who knew that detention could be so much fun, you guys? <laughs> Muscle! Muscle!
you. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. Come on, no, I don't. Yes, you do. Every time you buy a drink like that, you spill it and cause some kind of disaster. Is that so? Yeah, it's so. Name one time that's happened. Hmm, let me think. Hmm? Finally! <laughs> <laughs> or what about that other time? You just press it, and we will win the National Mathematics Cup. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and how could we forget that one time you... <laughs> of course, there's that other time when... I can keep going if you want. Okay, but come on, really? Just look at where we are right now. We're in a solar and hydro-powered town where everything's connected. Everything's computerized, even the cars. Nothing can ever go wrong here. It's basically perfect. Let's just go have fun. You have absolutely nothing to worry about. Hello there, boys. Hop in. Let us go for a ride. Careful with the drink. Huh. Huh? Uh -huh. Huh. My name is Wassel. I am the first of a brand new generation of smart cars. And today, I am now going to take you on a short tour of Eco Town. Huh? Whoa! Wassel! Is somebody controlling you from a command center? All the smart cars in Ecotown are connected through a central server, but every car drives itself. We're 100% automated down to our processing. You are pretty impressive. I am powered by solar energy, plus capable of driving and talking. My main interface is the control panel that is located right in front of you. It senses smoke, temperature, human touch, and smells. <laughs> it sounds like the only thing you're missing is a social media page with selfies. <laughs> I already have one. Now smile. Oh. Oh, you're Whoa. gonna spill it. Watch, you're gonna spill it and something bad's gonna happen. We are Something's not right. Take it one car at a time. I will steal this technology and then dump a self-destruct virus into the system. It will set them back years while I profit from their hard work. Mansoor, what's going on? I'm trying to fix it. Fix it faster, Mansoor, or we'll slam straight into that wall. What? Huh? What? Overrule! Overrule! That was a close one. <laughs> hey, boys. Thanks, Mansoor. I'll take over the drive now. Oh, no. Oh, boy. This is so much fun. It's been ages since they let me drive. <laughs> I wonder why. A 
disobeyed. What are you drinking? What is that? Is it really good? <laughs> I'm just curious. Yeah, it's my favorite. Really? It is mine too. I love strawberries. Yeah, with everything. With ice cream, with juice, yogurt, with jelly, and slushies too. Smoothies. You can't get away from me. And I will show you. Ha! So can I? What? Have a little bit. Huh? Just a little bit. Uh, oh, please. Uh, Pretty please. Mansoor? Keep him busy. I think I found the brakes. Ugh, forget the brakes. We need to get out of here. This isn't an accident. There must be someone behind this. Nano, are all of the cars operating on the same network? Yes. But they've all been hacked, right? Right. Trace the signal so we can find out where it's coming from. No problem. That's great. OK, now we know where we need to go. Figure out how to get there. Strawberry smoothie. What is that with it? Vanilla? Wow, 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 wow! Yeah! Wow! Hey guys, you're going to have to sample this smoothie. Ah. Delectable. What I wouldn't give for another. Those strawberry smoothies are delicious food for my circuitry. I know where to get one, but we just need to do something first. It's not working. I'd better get out of here. No! No! <laughs> Let me out! Let me out of here! No! 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 Technology is for everyone. You can't steal it. Now let's go find some strawberry smoothies for Wassel. <laughs> and for everyone else.
you too? Are you ready to go fishing? I'm so ready. I'm ready too. I'm gonna catch the biggest fish ever. Where's Obeyed? He better not make us late. He made it! He's here! Hey there, guys! Hmm? Uh huh? What? <laughs> mm. What's that on your head? It's my lucky headwear. <laughs> <laughs> what makes your headwear lucky? It just is. I bet it's going to help me catch more fish than you've ever seen. <laughs> you know it's just headwear, Obeyed. No, this headwear is lucky, and I'm going to prove it. Huh? huh? Uh. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's very oh, lucky. Huh? I think you'll agree with me now that you've seen it. My headwear really is lucky. I bet the machine is broken. You can believe what you like. I know it's because my headwear is truly uh, lucky. Uh, uh, can I try your headwear, please? Mm, okay, oh. I guess you can, but make it quick. Uh. Hey! I'm in need of some luck, too. <gasps> wow! I can't believe I won. I've never seen anyone beat that machine before. The headwear is lucky. Obeyed was telling the truth. My Woo! turn now. Now, what do I want to be lucky with today? So, there's no such thing oh, as... I've oh. just won a quad bike! What? I entered a competition a few weeks ago. Thanks to this lucky headwear, they just told me I've won. Play. We have another turn with it. Wait, I haven't finished with it yet. How many quad bikes do you need? Uh, let go, let go already. You let go, stop. Enough, hey, it. hey, stop it. You're going to damage it. Stop it, guys. Lucky hats don't exist, you know. But you saw what just happened to all of us. I know, but good luck comes from hard work and making the most of opportunities. It's not from something you wear on your head. Mm. Mm. Give it back to Obey mm. so he can go and catch lots of fish. Yeah. I really want to make the most out of the fishing trip with my lucky headwear. Huh? <laughs> oh, oh, what the, the lucky, lucky headwear? <laughs> Let's go get it. Let's go. Back here. I'm going fishing! <laughs> There's only one way we can get it. What? We climb it. Uh, I knew it. <laughs> it's much higher than it looked from down there. <laughs> Hey guys, on the count of three, let go and we'll drop right on top of that canopy. One, <gasps> two, three. <gasps> Why didn't you let go? It's too far. No, it's not. And one, and two, drop. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Mansoor. Where are the others? They're chasing a seagull who swooped in and stole Obey's lucky headwear. Well, that means more fish for us to catch then. Mm. Come on, let's get going. Reel it in. There it is! Too bad. Says who? Uh. Huh? Hey, look! There it is! He's getting away! Guys, how are we supposed to 
get the headwear now. <gasps> With those oh. things. Oh. Huh? Jump up and grab the headwear on the count of three. Okay, ready? One, two, three! <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're never going to catch this seagull. Hello, boys. Hey, guys. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, hello. How's your afternoon? It's not as good as yours, I'm sure. Uh -huh. You haven't caught the seagull yet? No. Come on, let's go and get you boys uh -huh. something to drink. What's wrong with the machine? Terrible malfunction. It's been giving away free soda all day. You see? It was the faulty machine, not Lucky Headwear. But what about the toy machine? Is that faulty too? No, that works fine. I put it on the easy level every now and again. <gasps> Maybe the Gafia really isn't lucky. What about the message I received, telling me I'd won the competition? Yeah, that message arrived just after you put the headwear on. A coincidence. Well, I don't think... Uh? Oh, it's just told me to ignore the last message about winning. It was sent an error. I didn't win. The whole operation was a scam and there were never any real prizes. Well, that's the final bit of proof. That headwear wasn't lucky after all. <gasps> uh -huh. Hey! Uh -huh. Give me back uh -huh. my headwear! Why do you even want it back, Obeyed? It was a gift from my grandfather. I don't know how I'm ever going to get it back now. Hmm. Obeyed, do you still have that coin the soda machine gave you earlier? Here you go. <laughs> Thank you. We got the headwear back, but unfortunately, we didn't get any fish. Well, we yeah. got loads of fish, and we'll need some help eating everything. <laughs> That's for sure. Uh, can we help you with that? Of course. Who else am I going to ask to help us with all of this? Come on, let's go and eat all this delicious fish. <laughs> I promise we'll be so much help. Yeah, you won't believe how hungry, I, I mean, how helpful we'll be. <laughs> <laughs>
know I totally love this game. I could play it for hours and not get bored of it. Yeah, the graphics are amazing, aren't they? Sure are. Man, this is awesome. You guys sure do like this game. Unbelievable. I mean, it's not like it's real life either. You haven't even gotten off the couch. Do you want to go on a real adventure now? I'm flying out to Jordan, so I'll take you with me. You can go on a real adventure in real life. Hmm. Hold on. Will there possibly be aliens to encounter? <laughs> no, sir, Obeyed. There won't be any aliens, but there will be a lot of fun activities there. Does that sound good? All right. Wadi Rum, here we come. Good afternoon. This is Mohammed, our guide. They're in your hands. Hey! I couldn't hear you. What do you say, guys? Are you ready for an adventure? Yeah! yeah! Then follow me. Your transport awaits. <laughs> Those aren't your transport. Those are. Uh -oh. <laughs> Come on, come on. Everyone pick a camel. <laughs> I see you've met Saber. Yes, and I don't think he likes me. What? Nonsense. You two will be best of friends in no time. I know it. Okay, everyone get on. Good boy. You're a good boy. Easy, easy now, okay? Okay. <laughs> That's the funniest thing I've seen! <laughs> I see what you mean. It is really funny. <laughs> <laughs> Look it! Look at my camel's funny ears! You guys see them? Huh? Huh? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Everybody, you doing okay? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ah, look there. Oh, wow. Hello. This is a good place for a picture. Got my trusty cell phone. Oh. Oh. Nice of everyone <laughs> to wait for us. They're just around the corner <laughs> over there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, unbelievable! This view is incredible! Miss Thor, huh? tell him! Obey! I'm down here! Hear that? I thought I just heard Turkey calling out. Mm -mm. Must be the wind. The wind doesn't know our names, though. Maybe the heat is getting to you, Obeyed. Drink some water. Miss Thor, huh? tell him! Obey! Huh? Help me! Oh, where is it coming from? Uh. uh... I don't know. Let's get your dad and Mohammed over here. Yeah, that's a good idea. Oh. Uh. Uh. Man, Mansoor! Huh? Solon just huh? fell in there. Uh, what happened? Well, he fell down this hole here. Salem! Turkey! Can anybody hear me? Hey, Mansoor! <gasps> Salem! Turkey! Where are you? We're stuck down here! Can't you guys see? Hold on! Just hold on! We'll throw down some rope! Don't be scared! Here! Look up! We can't reach it! It's too short! Uh, um... Obey! Tie this end around that rock! I'm going to climb down and see if they throw their rope up, we can join them together. Uh, uh, oh, 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 oh. Hey. 
Wish me all kinds of luck, my friend. Good luck. <laughs> Mansoor, right here. Are you okay? Yeah, fine. So what's the plan, huh? Tie your ropes together and throw one end up to me. Mm-hmm. And now we can all climb out. Huh? Oh, no. Oh. 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 Obeyed, what's up? No, 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 no! What happened? The rope came undone. I couldn't hold it any longer. Now what do we do? Um... Mm. Um... Uh, are there any tunnels or paths around here? There huh? aren't. We've checked. Huh? It's one big dead end. There's no way out of here. Whoa. Wow. This looks like a really cool level. Like in one of our video games. Stop talking about stupid video games, Obeyed! Actually, I think he's on to something. Obey, if this was your favorite video game, what would you do now? Mm, okay, well, if I couldn't go that way for some reason, then I'd go this way and find an alternate escape route. Well, let's go! Lead the way, Obeyed. We're in your hands. <laughs> Mansoor, do you really think this is a good idea? Well, it's better than just standing around. Who knows what he'll stumble into? Okay, let's go. Ah! Whoa! Ooh. Hey, wait! <laughs> from here. Hey! You okay? I'm so relieved you're safe. You had me really worried. So tell me, how did you find your way out? Well, it was actually Obeyed who led us to safety because he made excellent use of his video game knowledge. Isn't that right? <laughs> <laughs>
can't just play video games all summer. I can't believe I'm going to say this. But when are we going back to school? It's not that bad, Obeyed. Okay, maybe not that bad. Mansoor, tell us, how's your helicopter coming along over there? Not well at all. I don't understand it. The batteries are too heavy, so I need a new power source. Other than that, I can't think of anything. Then let's all think. It's my problem. Mm, it's 4.30, so we could go down to the beach. It won't be too hot, and it'll be better than just sitting around here, right? Mm, I suppose so. Oh, look at that bike, guys. Oh, nice. Oh. Whoa, hey man, I like your bike. <laughs> yeah, I'm bored with it. Oh. I'm getting a much better one this weekend. Really? Another bike? Is it your birthday or something? Uh, no, all I had to say was I want one. My dad gets me whatever I want. Hey, um, can I have a go on it? Yeah, sure, why hey. not? Go ahead. Huh? Where's your helmet? Oh, please, only babies wear helmets. Uh-oh. Um... <sighs> Here. Thanks, man. Oh. <laughs> Hi, I'm Ghazi. Ghazi Harib. Hmm. You want one? No, I'm all right. I don't like that sort of drink. Do you want to ride my bike? I'll make them get off if you want. Oh! Hey! No, thank you. You don't have energy drinks or bikes. So what do you like? I'm dying to know. Plenty of things. Such as? Mm, engineering, inventing, traveling, exploring. <sighs> Go on. What else do you like? I like football, jujitsu, science. Science? My father bought me the most advanced chemistry set, but I thought it was totally boring. Chemistry is only one aspect of science. There's physics, biology. Oh, please. Boring, 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 and disgusting. All of it is gross. Ugh. Uh. <sighs> my father says having one of these is like having a solar panel on my head. It gives me loads of energy. Ah, solar panel booster. That's it. That's what's been missing. Salem! Obeyed! I'm going oh. home right now to work on my helicopter. Do you want to join me? No, no, no. Wait just a moment. Don't leave with him. Stay with me. I haven't gone on the bike yet. Uh-huh. That's okay. I'll see you guys later. And sure, remember. Don't do the test flight without us, okay? I won't. Bye, then. Oh, wait. You didn't tell me your name. I know. Turkey? Mansoor, where's Salomon Obeyed? At the beach, playing with Ghazi Harib's new bike he's been riding around. Who's Ghazi Harib? A boy with nice things, but a bad attitude and a mouth to go with it. Oh, one of them. I get it. What are you doing with that thing? Putting solar panels onto my helicopter. I sort of got the idea from that spoiled brat. Mmm, I think it worked. Are you glad you met the spoiled brat? I'm not so sure about that, Turkey. It's ready. Let's go and find Solomon Obey. Thanks, Kazi. Let's go and get something to drink. No need. Uh -huh. Look here, I've got loads and loads of these in my bag. Dad uh -huh. gets them from somewhere. They have 10 times more sugar and caffeine than the stuff you can get in the shops. But you know what they say, too much sugar and caffeine is really bad for you. Really? Huh? They might say that. Who cares? Mm. I practically live on this stuff. Come on, let's uh, have some fun. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> 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 are absolutely crazy. <laughs>
Here, ah. have one of these. Whoa! Oh, come on, have some. I can feel the sugar wearing off already. <sighs> huh? Whoa! Mm. Uh, these are delicious! Oh, Bede, look at your tongue. No. It's totally bright blue. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> well, your tongue is green, Solomon. And yours uh. is orange, dude. <laughs> oh, what a day! <laughs> well, this is where they were. Here's the proof. This is the stuff he was drinking. Ugh, that stuff looks nasty. Hey, we didn't see them up there, so how about we look this way? <laughs> Ugh! Huh? Oh. Whoa! Wow. Come on, I've got a great idea for what we can do next. We should clear up the can, shouldn't we? Uh. Just uh. leave them! There are people who are paid to clean up. Hurry up! Turkey! Look there! Ugh. What is this? I know it can't be good for you. And neither can these. We are not going inside there! Don't be such scaredy cats. No one ever comes around. Now this is gonna be fun. Why don't you take the bike up there? Huh? Uh, wait, this doesn't look safe at all. Stop being such a baby. You want to have fun, don't you? Yeah, but... But what? So it's okay to drink my drinks and eat my sweets, but you won't play my games? Come on, is that fair? Uh... Oh, my goodness. Uh, uh, I think we should go down. Yeah? You want to go down? Then ride down that. It'll be a lot of fun. No way. You don't have much choice. Huh? Uh, uh, oh, no. Oh. Oh. Hmm? Well, look at that. He left a garbage trail for us to follow. I mean, come on, does he really... I just can't. <gasps> I just can't, man. I can't. Oh. I really, really can't. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Obeyed! Hey! Whoa. Uh, oh, wait up! Uh -huh. What are you doing? <laughs>
know you absolutely love pizza. Oh. And we know you like burgers. Oh. Mm? Huh? Yum! But what could possibly be better than pizza and burgers? Why, pizza burgers, of course. Mm. Two juicy burgers with cheese surrounded by double pepperoni pizza buns with extra cheese, all topped with our special tiger cheese stripes. Mm. Just one bite, and you'll never want to eat anything else in your life again, ever. Uh, I suddenly feel a little... Me too. Not sure how to explain it. What's the word? Starving. Uh, tiger burger? Thought you'd never ask. I'll race you there. Huh? Wait a minute. We just had lunch. Hmm, weird. Yeah, it's inexplicable. Come on, then. But guys! Hmm. We have an anomaly. Hmm? I don't think it's very healthy. We shouldn't be eating it. Huh? This place feels empty. Uh... Huh? Mm -hmm. huh? Something isn't right. Where is everyone? Mansoor! Everything will be fine when we get to Tiger Burger. Tiger Burger! Uh, hey guys! There must be a way across to get there. <laughs> Are those security guards actually running toward us? There he is! Hey guys! I really think they're coming for us! What if we uh, walk around? Mansoor! We need to get out of here! Now! <gasps> Mansoor! Oh, uh, don't worry. I'm actually a hypnotist. Leave them to me. These boys are not the ones for whom you are seeking. <laughs> These boys are not the ones for whom you are seeking. Are you sure? They look a lot like them. The tall one, the skinny one, the short one. Uh, um... These boys are not the ones for whom you've been seeking. Yeah, they're the ones. Look, I've got a photo on my phone. Here. Yep. That's them, all right. No, uh, mm -mm, mm, uh... Look into my eyes and listen. These boys are not the ones for whom you've been seeking. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Huh? Why does he keep saying that? Huh? Um, excuse oh. me? But what are you trying to do? Uh, don't worry. Uh, <clears throat> listen here. Look into my eyes. You're a chicken. You're a baby. You're a puppy. Bark! Mark! Uh, let's get out of here! Uh, oh. Quick! This way! Okay, someone needs to start explaining what is happening. Fast! Uh, fast? <gasps> You were hypnotized by the Tiger Burger ad you watched. Tiger Burger is actually an evil fast food chain that gets people to buy their unhealthy products by hypnotizing them through using display ads in malls all around the world. I'm Ahmed, by the way, and as part of a secret group of health-conscious hypnotists who are sworn to fight the big chain and free people from the evil hypnotists all over the world, like Tiger Burger. So what you're saying is you're a hypnotist? 
Exactly. Uh, sorry, but I get the feeling that you're new to this whole hypnosis thing. I am. These glasses were sent by HQ last week to help me. They're part of a new trial technology to help fight the evil hypnotists, but they just don't seem to be working really well right now. Huh. Uh, I don't know what it is. It could be any number of things. The RAM, the operating system, a software bug, or the new update I just downloaded. Or it could be as something... When did you last charge them? Uh... Seriously? I knew it. The first chance I get to do some real damage to the Tiger Burger Empire, and I failed. And now I'll never be able to help all those poor people. Wait a minute. There's just enough battery in these for one last burst of usage. Uh, how much good is that gonna do with all those people out there? Look, in essence, these glasses here project images onto your retina, right? Uh, right. I know that look too well. He's going to do something. Oh, oh no! And so, your brain deciphers the images shown and understands the code embedded within the light signals, right? Uh, right. So we don't really need the glasses at all. Uh, no, no, you're right. All we really need... ...is a means to project those same images onto your retina. But, but how do we implement this plan? Plan? What plan? I didn't hear about any plan. Did you? Why are you talking about science? It always gets me a bit confused. Well, first we will need a distraction. See what I was talking about? I sure hope he knows what he's doing. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> All I need to do is reprogram the format that it will play out, and it should be fine. If I could have your attention, please, gentlemen. I don't think so. oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Look into my eyes, oh, gentlemen. Look into my eyes. Oh, oh, I, uh... Thanks for all your help, boys. I couldn't have done it without you. What will you do now? There are still many malls out there and many more Tiger Burgers to defeat. I figure I'll just go from mall to mall, taking them on one at a time, helping out the good people and keeping them healthy. 
Until we meet again, take care of yourselves and each other. Ha-ha! Goodbye! How's it going, boys? We're nearly there. Right now, we're passing a tiny little island near Bermuda. Uh, the Bermuda Triangle? Hope we don't disappear. Ah! Oh, what was that? Just a thunderstorm. But I better get back to the controls. Buckle up, boys, all right? Look at the lightning! It's pink! <laughs> you watch too many movies, Obaid. It was only a storm. But, Dad, I can't get any service on my phone at all. Why don't you boys try up there? There may be a signal. Try that, and I'll look at the engine. But listen, don't go too far. Okay, Dad. See you later. Come on, guys. Yeah, <laughs> let's. <laughs> Come on. Mm. Guys, guys. Huh? Over here! Look there! Uh -huh. They look like pirates! <laughs> no way! You guys, don't be silly! It's a movie shoot! Let's go check it out! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Our quest is almost at an end, my friend! <laughs> and cut! Huh? 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 Mm -hmm. Hold uh -huh. on. They're only boys. Who are you? Um, I'm Mansoor. And these are my friends, Obaid and Salem. Are you shooting a movie? Movie? What is this movie? You know, a movie. Like this. Mm hmm? Look there. I'm making some action. Oh. <laughs> what is this? The boy has trapped little people inside of this little box thingy. What's with these guys? Hey, Jabal, secure the boat. My name is Sinbad. Sinbad? You mean just like Sinbad the sailor? Sailor, adventurer, hero at your service. Mm. Mm -hmm. What's going on? I'm so confused right now. That guy's crazy. Maybe not. Think about it. The storm, my phone acting all weird and stuff, and these guys over here don't even know what a movie is. You mean the Bermuda Triangle? I think you were actually right about everything, Obaid. That storm was a time portal. <clears throat> Forgive me, but time is not my friend. You see, we have sailed the seven seas far and wide to reach this far-off place. My princess fails even as we speak. Princess? Princess Alia. Alia of Baghdad. She has been poisoned by the evil Sultan Kader. And Kader wishes to claim her throne, and I must save her now. The only thing that can save the princess from her fate is the Star of Nashira, a tiny flower that grows only here on this island. A flower? 
That sounds easy enough. I wish that were true, my young fellow. But the flower grows at the top of a giant tree in the Valley of Scorpions. Scorpions? Well, at least it isn't snakes. Snakes, too. Many snakes to be, in fact. But now we must go. Ready, Jabal? Wait up, Sinbad. Maybe we can help. <laughs> I believe these tunnels right here will lead us to the giant tree. Uh, I don't really like this. It looks dangerous. Oh, it is. So touch nothing. The men who built this place filled it with many traps to prevent anyone from entering. <laughs> Follow me. Let's go. Let's go. Stop! Is something wrong? Yes, I think I see something. Hmm. Hmm, hmm. <laughs> I knew it, just as I thought. The traps that were put in place are still working. What do we do now? We make shields. Huh? Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> Salem, you look like a real warrior with that shield you made. Jabal, go and make some more for the rest of us. We're here. Behold, the Star of Nashira. Oh. Hold on. Do you really think this will hold no, us? No, don't do it. Oh. Oh. So. All to, is lost. Oh, to have come so far and to then fail. The fate of my princess is sealed now. Hmm. Not so fast. I've got an idea. Huh? What is that thing? Meet my friend Nano. He's going to save the princess. Oh, oh wow. Oh. Greetings there, Mentor. Hey, Nano. Got a little job for you. That is absolutely incredible. That's Nano. I owe you a great debt, Mansoor. And all of you, you will be heroes. And many stories will be told of you, I promise. Mansoor, look! The huh? storm! Oh. oh! The time portal! We have to leave now! Take this. 
as a token of gratitude. <laughs> Goodbye! Goodbye! Master! Huh? Uh? Dad! <laughs> Good luck, Sinbad! We're about 20 minutes away from New York. Funny thing is, we're somehow eight hours behind schedule now. It's probably something about the Bermuda Triangle. I think you're right, Obaid. I think you're right. It's entered Earth's orbit. Ooh, there it is. It's on target to land as predicted. Oh, <gasps> what's happening? It's not responding. Follow it. Where's it going? I don't have a clue. We don't have anything for show and tell today. Mansoor, are you sure you don't have anything to show in class today? Hmm, well, I'm working on that. Hey! Look, guys! Mm -hmm. ah! <laughs> oh. Run away! Ah! Ah! Me! got squashed by a meteor, obeyed. But I did get some great video footage. Uh, Let's take a look. Come on. Uh, it's not a meteor. It's actually a UFO. <laughs> 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 about it. Greetings there, Mansoor. Nano, can you find out who our new friend is, please? Over there? Sure thing, Mansoor. 
Looks like they're having some kind of robo chat. He says that he's a deep space rover and that the space authority are on their way to collect him soon. Well then, why doesn't he just stay in one place? Can you ask him to stop digging and wait for the space authority? He says that he cannot stop because it is what he is programmed to do. <laughs> yeah. Nano, can you override his system? Overriding system initiated. Override complete. There we go. As long as Nano's attached, he can stop all that digging. Oh, we're late for school. <laughs> yeah, but now we have the best thing for show and tell. Mm -hmm. mm. Next up for show and tell is, uh, Tarek. <laughs> I have brought this today with me to show everyone. No one can have a go. It's all mine. Ooh. Ooh. Great, thank you, Tarek. Next up is Mansoor. <laughs> I bet you won't have anything better than this to show the class, Mansoor. Actually, we have something out of this world to show the class. Literally. Really now? <laughs> Where is it? <laughs> <laughs> Nano, it's time to bring him in. Uh. <laughs> 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 this robot crashed in the park today. That's right, and it came from outer space. <laughs> wow, I don't believe it. It was collecting samples from deep space. Can we see some samples? <laughs> he says that the rock is from a moon that is located 1,000 light years away from Earth. <laughs> he says, don't touch that. <laughs> unless they are given an antidote very soon. But what's the antidote? He said he has all the necessary ingredients in his pod that crashed in the park. We'll need to retrieve them. All right, then what are we waiting for? Let's hurry, guys! Just make an extra antidote. Warning, warning, low battery power. can't stop. Nano needs to override his system. But Nano's got no battery. What are we going to do? Give me your cell phones and phone cables, too. If I can manage to reroute the power from the cell phones to Nano... Got it! All right, you did it, 
Mansoor? We've got to get back to school now. He says, let's make an antidote. End of class already. I'll see you all tomorrow. Great, robot. We did it. Don't forget all the people in the playground. Oh, we have three minutes. Quickly. Hurry, Mansoor. We can go home now. <laughs> Thank you for looking after him. No problem. It was our pleasure. I hope he hasn't been too much trouble for you. Uh, no, no trouble. He says that he's had more fun with you three today than he ever had out in deep space. He would like you to have this. Really? Well, he did take plenty of samples, so you kids can have them. Thank, Thank you. you! Come on, <laughs> let's go. Everyone ready to go camping? Yeah! yeah. Mm. Well, let's go then. <laughs> Spending spring break in the desert. I do too. Camping under the stars is great. Racing dune buggies is really fun. And eating uh. food cooked on an open fire. <laughs> <laughs> this trip is going to be so amazing. But will there be any Wi Fi uh, there? Salem! If I drive a little bit faster, we'll be there in time for lunch.
Is it time to drive them yet? We'll have lunch first. Hey, how are you liking this so far? Uh, I can't get any signal. Of course you can't. You're in the middle of the desert. Entertain yourself the old-fashioned way. What is the old-fashioned way? Telling stories. Why don't you tell us one? Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, one day I was walking down the street and I saw a cat. That's your story? That's all you can tell us about it? One day I saw a cat? All right, why don't you tell one then? Okay, I will. Once upon a time, a long time ago. Well, actually, it was just last month. <laughs> I bought some ice cream, but I forgot to put it in the freezer. An hour later, I remembered. I rushed back home to get to it. But to my surprise, I discovered that the ice cream had completely melted. And so, I thought to myself, what am I going to do now? Aha! Uh -huh. Then I had a great idea. I'll drink it with a straw. So I ended up having a delicious ice cream milkshake instead. It was so good! That's the end. <laughs> well done, Obeyed. That's a very nice story. How about you tell us one of your stories, Grandpa? I will tell you a scary story. When I was a little boy, my mother used to warn me not to go and play outside in the afternoon because Humarat al Gaila hunts for children at that time. Humarat al Gaila has a human face, but the legs of a donkey. One day I did go play in the afternoon, and I saw Humarat al Gaila. I was terrified. She approached me and said, Lunch is ready. <laughs> Grandpa. What did Humarat al Gaila say? <laughs> I'll finish the story this evening. Let's go eat. Come on. I really can't wait to hear the rest of the story. <sighs> I don't like the sound of this Humarat al Gaila. Guys, are you ready for some fun? Oh, yeah, we're ready. Let's go. Can we come too? No, boys only. <laughs> hey! Hmm. <laughs> Be careful and watch out for Humarat al Gaila. Humarat al Gaila? I've got an idea. <laughs> How's this look? Perfect. <laughs> Let's go after them. <laughs> Cool, that was an awesome ride, you guys. Hey, guys, who wants to come fly my new kite? I do. I do, too. I'll just stay here and look after the buggies. <laughs> Mansoor, wait for me! Mm. <laughs> mm. Ah, yeah, this is the life. Solemn's right there. Okay, are you ready? Ready. Now let's go and teach Solemn a lesson. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Watch out for Humarat al Gaila. She comes for children in the afternoon. Solemn. Uh -huh. Will you please help me, my friend? Thank you. Oh. You're a lifesaver. Uh, 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 what happened? Uh, 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 it's just me, Shama. Uh, uh, Huh? What happened? Well, we were really upset. You didn't let us go buggy riding with all of you guys just because we're girls. It wasn't fair. So, 
We decided to dress up as Humarat al Gaila and teach you a lesson. But our trick worked a bit too well. We're very sorry. Huh? Huh? <sighs> Thank goodness! I've been saved! I'm sorry I said you couldn't join us. That's okay, Salem. I'm also glad it wasn't really Humarat al-Gaila. There's nothing to worry about. Mm. Humarat al is not real. Whoa! Whoa! Stop! Huh? Huh? <sighs> Oh, please tell me this is just another joke. Uh, no, it's not. Oh, she is oh. real. <laughs> what are we gonna do? We have to get out of here. That's a great idea. Run away! <laughs> <laughs> Grandpa! Grandpa! <laughs> we saw Humrat al Gaila! What? Uh -huh. Humrat al Gaila's out there! You mean you saw Shaman Kalud pretending to be Humrat al Gaila? Well, Solim saw the Humrat al Gaila and he fainted. But then we saw the real Humrat al Gaila! You know, I think your scary story was a little bit too scary for the kids. <laughs> Calm <laughs> down, children. Humrat al Gaila is just an old folk tale. I didn't mean to scare you this much. We enjoyed the story, Grandpa. But what we saw was real. But, Mansoor, there's no such thing. <laughs> I don't believe uh -huh. it. Humarata <laughs> Gaila, I told you she was real. Please help me. Hmm? Grandpa, no! <laughs> water. Bring me water. Uh, thank you. Come on, rest by the fire. I just brewed some coffee. Thank you very much. Uh-huh. Grandpa, do you think you can please finish telling us the story about how you met the Humorat Algaila in the desert? No, no, please don't know. I've already met her twice today. Well, okay then. Why don't you tell us another riveting story about meeting a cat? <laughs> <laughs> Guess what, you guys? We're going on a family holiday to Egypt next week. I'm so excited! Whoa! You're so lucky! When do you leave? Saturday. I thought so! What a coincidence! I'm gonna be your pilot. Isn't it funny when things like that happen? Hmm. Hey, how about you three come along as well? There's huh? nothing like the huh? wonders of Egypt. Huh? Yes! Yes! Please! please. Sure yeah! Will. So guys, here's the plan. You can explore on your own for as long as you want. Then we're gonna meet later when it's dark for the laser show. <laughs> Most ancient Egyptian pyramids were built as tombs for pharaohs and for their families as well. This pyramid huh? was built with about 2.3 million stone blocks and it is thought to weigh 5.9 million tons. Wow. Wow, we it's huge. The only thing bigger than uh -huh. the pyramids are the lines to get in. Huh? That one hasn't got a line outside of it. Huh? Mm -hmm. I say we go. Huh? Oh, it's very nice and way cool in here. 
Strange, you know. There's no one else here. Funny. There's nothing in my book about this pyramid. Well, then what does the book say? It says Egyptian pyramids often contain multiple chambers and passages. I say we go and explore them. Oh, wow. Beautiful. Uh oh. Oh. Uh, mm -hmm. Huh? Look there. Look at all those hieroglyphics on the wall. How do we get over there? Huh? Huh? Oh. No, 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 Huh? I think this is a puzzle. Right. We answer the riddles correctly, and we get out of here with our lives intact. What if we don't answer correctly? Um, um, well, let's make sure we do answer correctly. What's this one here? What is this donkey plus these mountains? Shawarma! What? I found a shawarma in my bag. Obeyed! Mmm. Mmm. A donkey plus two mountain peaks could be a camel. Hey, I think you're right about that. Yeah. Mm, uh huh? Hmm. Uh, um. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Right. Let's get that door open already. Huh? Uh huh? Uh -huh. Oh. A cat and a wolf. Um, I know. That's an oh, owl. Obeyed. Wait, uh, stop. Oh. How can a cat and a wolf be an owl, Obeyed? It was obviously a lion. How can you confuse the two of them? I got confused. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It won't happen again. Everyone, calm down, all right? No one presses a button until we're all sure about it. Okay, guys? Yeah. Hmm, that could be some kind of a lizard. Or a crocodile. True, but which one, Shama? Could this be any harder? I think it's a crocodile. Yeah, me too. We have to be so careful about this. <laughs> Not again! I think a bird and a lion is a hawk. I do too. So do I. Yep. Oh my goodness. This is not good! Hey, guys! Uh, uh, the mummies! The mummies are gone! What are you uh, talking about, Obeyed? The mummies aren't back where they were anymore! Mm. I'm not lying! It's just your mind playing tricks on you, Obeyed. Huh? Uh, 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 oh no. Uh, I, 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 At least 
we're safe for now. Uh, okay, guys. I think we should turn around. Uh, huh? Ah! We gotta get out of here and quick! I agree. Maybe this symbol means exit. Um, K, actually, it means treasure. Egyptians buried their dead with expensive items such as jewelry. Now isn't the time for a history lesson. There huh? are mummies uh, on the loose. Mm. Huh? Mummies? And scary dog-faced walking statues. Huh? Mm. Uh, what are those? <gasps> Run, you guys! <gasps> doing on our side of the ride? I didn't think any customers would be here yet. Huh? <gasps> What's going on here? This theme park doesn't open until next week. I'm sorry. Oh, no. Did you think all this was real? It'd be awesome if you did. Um, yeah. <laughs> well, then, now that you know it's a theme park, would you like another go? What do you say, everyone? Yeah! <laughs> sure, that would be swell. You, Grandpa, are you ready? Yeah, sure. Salem, huh? obey. Huh. Ready? Yeah, ready. Okay, science project homework. Scene one, take one. Action! Let's investigate the different properties of solids, liquids, and gases. Terrific idea. Take a look at all these liquids here. They can either flow or pour like this, but they're not that easy to hold, though. No, sir. It's quite impossible. Solids keep their shape. They do not flow like liquids. They serve their own purpose. That's right. And look over there. If you were to heat up a liquid, it can turn into a gas. Hmm. And 
cooling a liquid can turn it into a solid. Isn't science just so fascinating? Elementary, my dear Obeyed. Cut! <laughs> hey, well done, everyone! Our science project is complete! <laughs> <laughs> What's that? It's called acting. No, not that. I mean that! What's she up to? I have no idea, but she's trying not to be seen. Hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a riddle that must be solved. Elementary, my dear Mansoor. The case of the mysterious cousin. <laughs> huh? Oh, huh? there's our culprit now. Look. We must follow her at once. There. <laughs> See any clues? Not a single one. Let's look over here. Oh, hello, guys. Uh, Shama, uh, fancy seeing you here. <laughs> yeah, um, listen, I've got to go. See you later. Mmm, the plot thickens like clam chowder soup. The case of the mysterious cousin becomes more mysterious. Come on, let's see where she's going. I think she saw us. Quickly, in here, in here. She'll never recognize us now. Let's go. What's in that package? That's a picture frame for sure. I wonder who she's talking to. Maybe her partner is a criminal mastermind. Yeah, that is the only logical explanation. Oh, ah, here they come right now. It's your uncle and auntie. Are they criminal masterminds we're dealing with? I didn't think they were, but we gotta find out for certain. What do you think is in that box? I bet it's a big pile of money or jewelry. Uh, 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 sorry. Uh, huh? Uh, our bad. Quick, they're getting away. What does the evidence tell us, my dear Obeyed? Well, I'll tell you. The culprit is parked near the exit for a quick and easy getaway. They're more cunning than we expected. A fine deduction. But what do you suppose Shama's doing there? Probably finding the most expensive, most rare piece of art to run off with. So let's go and catch her red-handed like the criminal she is. Huh, where has she gone? Right there. Oh. She got away. She is a most devious foe. Don't you worry. We will find her. Come on, detective friends. Let's go this way. Huh? What's going on? It's probably just a fire alarm test. Or perhaps there's a robbery going on. No way. She couldn't possibly have done this. Of course not. We're just having a bit of fun. We don't really think that Shama stole a painting, do we? Hmm. Hmm. Hey, guys, you need to look at this. Nano, can you identify this picture, please? 
It is the Morning Sunrise, a very valuable painting, currently being displayed in the City Art Museum. Currently being stolen from the City Art Museum? Thanks so much, Nano. Listen, I don't believe Shama really took the painting, so let's do some real detective work. If the picture is still here, we know Shama didn't take it. That makes sense. Let's go. According to this, the morning sunrise painting should be right over there. What on earth? Oh, she actually took it. I can't believe it. There's no way. This just got really serious, you guys. <gasps> no! Impossible! But look at the evidence. She acted suspiciously in your garden. She was acting so weird in the mall. And the alarms went off. And Shama totally left with the painting. Yeah, and now it's not here. No, there must be a logical explanation for this. There is! Your cousin and her family are art thieves. We gotta tell the police. No! I need to speak to her first. Hello? Hey there, Shama. How are you? I'm good, and you? Uh, good, thanks for asking. Did you do the homework? Of course. It was good seeing you at the mall. Oh, I didn't see Oh, you. that's okay. I understand that you were in a rush. Yeah. What else have you been up to? Just got home after shopping. You just went home? Bye. Oh, okay, okay. Right. Yeah, yeah, I'll see you at my house later for dinner, yeah. See you soon. Okay, then, bye for now. All right, bye. I don't believe it. Shama actually stole it! A priceless masterpiece from the museum! And to think she's going to put that beautiful painting in the cheap gold frame from a stinky old mall! Wait, she's coming to your house for dinner later? Yeah. What are you going to do? I guess I'll have to confront them. And I need you two there. Take a seat, fellas. Mansoor, I'll be away on holiday next week, so I won't be around for your birthday. But I still wanted to get you a present. Um, thank you. I've shown it to everyone, and they think it's great. Your entire family is in on this. It wasn't easy to get, though. I couldn't find it in the mall, so instead I had to go somewhere else. <laughs> so happy birthday, Mansoor! You may not want to show this. You might want to keep it private. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Shama. Thank you. Mm. <gasps> huh? <laughs> <laughs> what? The three of you are the worst detectives ever, you know that? <laughs> uh, I don't understand, Shama. Let me explain this to you. Okay, so I went to the mall so I could get you the frame that you're holding. And then I went to the art museum to get you this print of a beautiful morning sunrise. Mm. But I saw you three running around in those silly beards. I didn't think you had seen us. How could I miss you guys? I mean, really. But then how do you explain this morning in the garden? You were filming something, and I didn't want to ruin your shot. What about the alarms? And the missing painting? The painting was removed to be cleaned, but they accidentally set the alarms off. Nothing nefarious going on there. It was on the front page of the newspaper, you know. I'm sorry, Shama. You really thought the evidence was overwhelming. <laughs> the evidence is overwhelming that you three are crazy. What about the box full of money and jewelry? Someone explained that to me. Huh? <gasps> oh! <laughs> <laughs> you jumped to the wrong conclusions. What do you got to say about that? Uh, who would like some cake? <laughs> <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.